Hey everyone, the container guy here. I got some big news. We just got the keys to our brand new facility. So we have two and a half acres and at this place we are going to take a serious stab at all of the prototyping, the design, manufacturing and sales of the parts and accessories and also perform our modifications here. With the added capacity we are going to bring on more engineers and more designers and try and develop products specific to the container home following. These are going to assist you along with our direction on how to perform do-it-yourself modifications to shipping containers. Follow along. Go check this place out. We still have all the concrete yet to do. We're hoping to do in-floor heat inside of this thing. It's nice, uh, nice and warm to work on, especially in our Canadian winters. But also, when we bring containers into our shop, a lot of times they have a lot of snow on the roof, and when that melts, that helps that evaporate and get that water off the ground. So if we're not doing uh, floor drains inside of here because we're not really hooked up to uh, uh, city sewer, we have to do septic tanks. But a lot of times you have to suck that out anyway, just in case there's contaminants in there. But we're not doing floor drains, so we definitely want to go with in-floor heat. That's both comfortable for our employees, but also uh, an efficient way to heat these things. And so this thing's very well insulated. We still need to electrify it, uh, get all the gas in, hook up the bathrooms, all that. We're hoping to utilize some shipping containers inside of here for uh, some of the structures. So potentially build the washrooms out of a container maybe build a balcony using our upper decker brackets up above a container, maybe for a lunchroom, uh, then also maybe some project manager offices inside of Seacans, and we'll just shove those right inside of our shop. But if you guys have any sweet ideas, uh, either how to set up our shop in the most efficient way, or even better, modify a container that goes inside of here, please leave comments down below. We are all ears. This is the first time I've done this, and I would love advice from industry professionals who are watching so please do that also uh, if you want to follow along all the sweet modifications that we perform inside of here uh, subscribe to our channel help us out give the video a like and as always check us out at tcg.ca hope you learned something